Welcome to the amazing world of woodworking DIY projects and tool tips. Hello Carpentry Alley, welcome back to your favorite woodworking and DIY channel. I am Domingo Freire and today I am going to show you the Work Pro Portable Workbench. In the description of this video I will leave you the link to workprotools.store so you can see the features of this workbench and buy it. I am sure that it will be very helpful for you to work on projects outside of your workshop. The WorkPro portable workbench comes virtually assembled. The structure of the table is made of iron, which makes the table very solid and resistant to work on any woodworking project. In addition to the table with these pieces, we will build another structure that allows us to place other tools on top such as the meter saw. When we are working outside the workshop, this table allows us to use our tools more comfortably. With this table we will not have to work on the floor, and we will have an adequate surface to manufacture or install any project with greater efficiency. This is a piece of iron, a piece of the metallic structure that I will assemble after assembling the pieces of the table. To open the legs of the table, we simply press here and the movement of the legs is released. Changing the height of our work table is very easy. We press join in these two pins and we can move them. If we turn the pins, we immobilize the legs at the height that best we have to do it. We can use this workbench in three heights, 22, 26 or 30 inches. The WorkPro portable workbench has several uses. Table to work and assemble our projects. Table to place the meter saw. Scaffold to work at certain heights. Wheeled platform for easy transport of materials even as a stretcher with wheels to work on the mechanics in our car. The wheels on the bottom are going to be attached with this short bolt and using a log washer and a flat washer to get more strength when installing the wheels. These two swivel wheels make easier the multidirectional movement and we will each hold it with four screws. Remember that this work table can be used as a platform to transport materials or as a sliding stretcher if we want to make any mechanical repairs to our car. 5 inch non skid casters are attached to the other side of the work table. To hold them correctly, we use a flat washer and a nut. To place the handle we are going to use two screws that are a little longer. In order not to damage the head of the screw when holding the handle of the table, you must use a screwdriver with the PH2 tip, that's the tip that fits perfectly on the screw. Holes for mounting the handle are in one side of the workbench. This handle is very important for moving the portable table. This table has two work surfaces, a smooth one that is very useful for assembling woodworking projects and on the other side it has a honeycomb style metal surface. This non-slip surface is very useful when using our table as a scaffolding and when stacking or transporting heavy objects. Assembling the structure to place saws and other heavy tools is very easy. We are going to first join the plastic pieces to the two aluminum tubes using some screws. This is very easy because all the pieces have the perforations to place the screws. Then we are going to place this piece of metal in the middle of the structure so that it will support the weight of any saw on our table. The structure is attached to the table with four quick lever fasteners that grip firmly at the corners.
we will screw our saw to two pieces of metal that are clamped to the table with a quick lever system that you can release with this trigger. In this workbench we can place any meter saw. This structure works with any width measurements with any tool model. When we finish working with our saw, we remove the structure and we can use the smooth surface to assemble the pieces for any project. This table supports a weight of up to 303 pounds or 150 kilograms and allows you to work comfortably while standing or sitting in a chair. On one side we can connect the electric current to be able to have three outlets nearby to work with any electric tool. Also, on one side of the work surface we can place the tools with which we will work. On both sides of this surface we have two metric scales expressed in inches and centimeters and here we can verify any cutting angle of the pieces of our project. As the metal structure of our table is flat we can hold the pieces firmly with clamps when we are going to use our saw, sander or when working with our router. When we finish working it is very easy to store our table and transport it anywhere thanks to the wheels at the bottom. Also, I love that I can now move any piece of furniture without having to carry it all the way because I use my workbench as a skid plate. And there is nothing more fun than working comfortably to get good results. Now you know why I recommend this workbench. Remember to click on like, share and comment this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I love if you can help us to improve this channel clicking the super thanks button and I will see you in my next video.